so with that part three and the last section of grace and family that i'm going to read we'll finish this off now so we've got grace who loves stories lives with her nan and her mom and her cat in england she's going to go to africa to meet her dad again and she's going to go with her nan and she gets there and she sees her dad and she's very happy but when she meets her stepmother and brother and sister She's a bit upset because she thinks that she doesn't fit into their family. So she starts to be rude to her stepmother by uh, not eating the food that she's giving her and not talking to her. So then one day when her dad gets home from work, he asks her to try and be a bit nicer to Jatu. So they go to a market and see lots of colourful sights. And they go in a cloth shop and pick out um, the material to make Grace's first African dress. She plays in the ocean with her brother and her sister and she phones her mum and says that she feels like she's stretched so thin that she could burst. Um, but her grandma keeps reminding her that a family is what do you make it. So uh, yesterday I asked you to have a think about what your family looks like and I wrote down in the blog on the comments what my family looks like and I hope that you realise that everybody's family is different but it doesn't matter, family is always family. So let's see what happens next. Soon it was their last evening and there was a big farewell party at the compound. Grace and Nana wore their African clothes and Grace ate twice as much as twice as much Benjamin, Benjamin, Benjamin? as everyone else. Now you really might burst, said Nana. But Grace wasn't worried about bursting any more. She just wanted to dance with her African family. Can you see them all dancing? Grace chose that beautiful, colourful material for her dress. You've got all of her, brother, her brothers and sisters and her cousins and all the friends of the family all dancing together and having a big farewell party. On their last morning, Papa took Grace to see some real crocodiles. This is a special holy place, he said. The crocodiles are so tame you can stroke them. Not like the one in Peter Pan, said Grace. No, these are so special you can make a wish on them, said Papa. Grace closed her eyes and made a wish, but she wouldn't say what it was. Those are the crocodiles in the holy place, look. Grace has closed her eyes because she's got her hand on the crocodile making a wish. I wonder what she's wished for. Bet it's something to do with family. Later at the compound, Grace asked Nana, Why aren't there any stories about families like mine that don't live together? Well, at least you've stopped thinking it's your family that's wrong, said Nana. Now, all you have to do is make up a new story to go with it. I'll do that, said Grace, and when we're home again, I'll write it down and send it to Jatu to read to Nena and Bakaru. The whole family came to see them off at the airport. Grace was sorry to say goodbye to her stepmother and her new brother and sister, but leaving Papa was the hardest of all. Waiting for their plane, Nana asked Grace if she had thought any more about her story. Yes. But I can't think of the right ending, said Grace, because the story's still going on. How about they lived happily ever after, asked Nana. That's a good one, said Grace. Or they lived happily ever after, though not all in the same place. Stories are what you make them, said Nana. Just like family, said Grace. So you can see that Grace has gone back with her Nana, she's going back to England but she's going to write the story of her own family because Grace really likes reading stories. So maybe you could have a go at writing the story of your family. After yesterday and you wrote down what your family looks like, you could have a go at writing what your, what, the story of your family. You could either email it to me, write it down on a piece of paper or leave it in the comments of the blog. Okay, now for tomorrow, I've got two books you can choose from. We could either have The Snaggle Grammar or we can have Giraffes Can't Dance. 
if you leave a comment and vote on which one that you want i will choose that one if not i will just choose the one that i fancy tomorrow see you later bye